Hey, how's it hanging fellow patrons? Of course you know who it is, the good doc, Dr. Mike, back again, once again with another masterclass lesson for you guys today. In today's video, I wanted to talk to you guys about something special to me. Um, I'm pretty sure this will probably be one of the most viewed videos in the masterclass session, but today I wanted to talk to you guys about my key tips and my key secrets for flirting and talking and getting to know Filipinas on a more intimate, more, you know, intellectual type level, okay? I'm pretty sure you guys right now probably have your own science, your own methods to your madness about how you choose to talk to and deal with Filipinas. But today, I'm just going to give you a little bit of key tips that you may want to add to your repertoire, courtesy of the good Doc, Dr. Mike TV. Um, a lot of people have been asking me, Doc, how do you talk to Filipinas? I mean, you know, you don't need like pickup lines. You don't need things of that nature to help you get from point A to point B because a lot of the pickup lines that may work on women from your own home country may not work for women in foreign countries abroad. So you're going to need to develop a secondary way of being of approaching women in foreign countries. So. I'm just going to tell you a few things that have worked for myself during my time here in the Philippines and I do believe that it could be beneficial to you guys in any country in which you choose to travel to. Now, first things first, I made a video about learning the language in the Philippines, about should you learn the language in the Philippines. I have to openly admit when I say this that when it comes to learning the language in the Philippines, I've mentioned in the video before how important it would be if <laughs> you're trying to, you know, keep people from taking advantage of you, etc. But aside from that, what I've learned through my times of living here in the Philippines is that learning the language, girls find it to be cute and attractive when they hear you speaking the local language. They find it so adorable, like, oh, I like the way you say certain words, I find it to be cute. So I find it to be a breakdown in barriers when a Filipina or a woman abroad sees you trying your best to master the language. They find it cute, they find it endearing, and it definitely opens them up more when they hear you trying to speak it. You know, you don't have to be perfect. I'm not perfect at all. I'm, 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 I'm having my moments. But overall, I found that to be a way of breaking down the barriers. Just, you know, cute little words, things of that nature. You know, it's kind of like a little flirtation tactic. But when you're trying to speak the language towards them, some girls find it endearing. So it does open them up more to, you know, open them up more to your whims and the way in which you choose to have conversations with them.